The Catholic Church, although against the merciless killings and crimes of innocent people, says the death penalty is not seen as the solution. Archbishop Ribat reaffirms the church's statement made in 2013 that they are against the death penalty. The way forward to reduce crimes and maintain law and order is to improve our justice and policing system and rehabilitation programs. The stand is for the government to stick to life sentencing with hard labor. Our nation really is here to be able to protect, to promote, promote life, protect life, and, and really to, the laws are there to be able to, to make sure that if there are wrongs, if there are serious crime committed, then there's a way of addressing this. Eh? And to rush to death penalty is really against our principle. And if, if we are really a Christian nation, we are going against one of our most and important principles in life. Under PNG's criminal code, the offenses of treason, piracy and attempted piracy are punishable by death. The death penalty for willful murder was abolished in 1970 but reinstated in 1991. The last execution was before independence in 1954 when PNG was a colony of Australia. In July 2011, five men were sentenced to death for willful murder of eight people in a boat in the Duke of York Islands back in 2007. But no execution have been carried out due to an absence of regulations surrounding the process. However, in 2013, PNG Parliament voted to implement the death penalty and extend it to cases of aggravated rape and robbery and to permit executions by electrocution, hanging, lethal injection, suffocating and firing squad. Thirteen men are now on the death row. The government has seen fit. Now they have the, the right and the law to pass. Okay, we are voicing what we believe, what the church believes. What we all believe, it is really the Christian principle. And that's what we are standing by. And uh, the Catholic Church here stand firm to say that uh, death penalty is not the way to deter crime and it's not really the way to be able to stop these serious crimes. The Catholic Church is saying that PNG government is contradicting the country's principle of following the Bible and claiming PNG as a Christian country. Vastinata Yama, National MTV News.